Clean the apple orchard was a happy little orchard where the sun shined brightly and the apple trees blossomed happily. The little blossoms wondered what they would become as they began to turn into apples. They didn't have a care in the world and were happy to be growing in the beautiful orchard. Each knew that they were equally beautiful. The apples began to grow into all different shapes and sizes. The apples were red, green, multicolored, round, oval, short, and tall apples. The orchard was beautiful, and no two apples in Clayton's orchard looked alike. The apples were all content to be different until one fateful day in the early fall. The farmer walked down the rows of trees, admiring his fine orchard, until he stopped, reached up, and grabbed the most round, perfectly red, plump apple in the whole orchard. The other apples were jealous because they were not the first apples to be picked. As the apple picking season began, most of the apples picked were round, perfectly red, and plump. All the other apples in the orchard began to worry that they were not good enough to be picked. They were worried that they were too brown, multicolored, short, tall, narrow, fat, green, plain, small, or big. However, as hard as the apples tried to be round, perfectly red and plump, they could not change. The orchard became a cantankerous place and none of the apples were happy. As autumn began and the leaves started to fall, the apples grew increasingly discouraged. The apples no longer enjoyed the beautiful sunshine and spent all of their time talking about how much they wanted to be rounder, redder, and plumper. The apples called each other names like ugly, green, brown, yellow, fat, and small. Sadly, the orchard was no longer a happy place to live. The apples began to fall from their homes in the trees. As winter came, the apples lost their shape and began to rot into the ground. The apples all cried because they would never be round, perfectly red, and plump. As the apples began to dwindle into a moldy mess, they began to look exactly the same. Brown, moldy, and squishy. The apples began to realize that it was silly to want to all be round, perfectly red, and plump, because looking the same was boring. As the apples molded, they discovered that they had seeds inside them. These seeds would someday grow into big, beautiful apple trees that would grow apples for years and years. Each seed would create a new tree with red, green, yellow, round, oval, short, thin, or plump apples. Even though the apples never got picked, they were now going to become one of the most beautiful things of all, a tree. So because you were absent, what I'll need you to do is finish the activity that went along with this video. You just go under the Assignments tab, you'll find the Three Selves Worksheet. Fill that out with a friend and a parent, and then turn it in, and then you'll have completed today's assignments. Thanks!